Hey everybody, Wayne's Bear Delivery. We what? have... With me! Nutmeg <laughs> to Palmetto. We are here at Brewery 85. We just got done with the Upstate Beer Boys podcast interview with uh, Will McCameron of Brewery 85. So we figured, why not do a beer review on site? So, Heck yeah. So what we got is uh, Southern Style. It's their American Pale Ale. This is 5% alcohol by volume. Um, Greenville, South Carolina. You know, pale ales. You've got your Sierra Nevadas, a very famous for one. So let's uh, try this one. I, th I think our buddy Young David of Dave's TV will appreciate my uh, observation of the head retention staying above the rim of the glass. And if you could see it, there's a lot of carbonation still going up. So. But unlike most of my videos, there's no tilted pour, no hard pour. Just a straight, straight from board. the tap. Cheers. Cheers, my friend. I'm sorry, I didn't describe it. As you can see, it is pretty clear. It's got a nice white head. It smells like any other pale ale. But yeah, nothing too distinctive, but solid. No, nothing off putting either. Now, as far as the taste, you know, if uh, hoppy pale lagers or pale ales aren't your thing, this would be very enjoyable. It does have a nice hot presence to it. Very malty body to it. A nice clean finish. It's super it's smooth. Nice. It's super smooth. It's hoppy. And it's definitely got some bitterness to it. But it's not like... it's The bitterness is not overpowering at all. It's very subtle. Very back end. Yeah, it's not overpowering. Which is, which is good. Because the overpowering for someone coming into craft beer that's never been there before might be off-putting. And there's a lot of different ways you can be overpowering craft beer. Mm -hmm. this you is can true. have your stouts and your barrel aged where they're just the booziness kicks in the teeth. Mm -hmm. You can have your sours that the overpowering makes you pucker up like a little old man. And uh, you can have your over hopped hoppy IPAs that kind of the bitterness makes you eat like you're feel like you're eating a bad piece of fruit. Or drinking a pine tree. That's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, as you can see, like I said, it's very clear. What we learned in our interview, which you'll find out later in the Upstate Beer Boys podcast, is that they don't tend to do hazies. A lot. Yeah, it's it's kind of they kind of like got a little hipster vibe with uh, your run of the mill hazies of nowadays. But Brewery eighty five in Greenville, fantastic beer, uh, Southern style pale ale or. Mm, teaser it might be changing a name to southern pale ale we're not sure just keep an eye out um but if you can find this in your area i definitely would recommend well till next video chase cheers cheers and thanks again to will we had a blast a lot of fun great mm -hmm. episode and hopefully download and listen you'll hear our story all right cheers everybody